Welcome back to my channel. So today is Friday and so I'm going to take you guys through an entire weekend of my life now that I am in Florida, which is kind of insane to think about. I just feel like I'm going to be in a better mood, just going to have so many things to do throughout the weekend. So I'm really excited to show you guys all of this. So now that I am in Florida though, I actually need to wear a lot more SPF. I laid out today and um, I had SPF on my face. My chest and my arms are way more tan than my face and that's just because I do my skincare routine, I do a lot of masks. I need to be extra mindful now that I'm down in Florida. Like the sun is just different like it hits way different than in Ohio Ohio the UV index is maybe at a 9 Florida like it's like 11s and 12s so tonight I feel like me and my roommate are gonna maybe get like a drink somewhere we're determined to get some espresso martinis somewhere so we're trying to find a place to do that but we just haven't actually been out since we've moved in and it's been about a week now i have been feeling so ugly lately because my hormones are going insane like you can just see how mm, i think right now i'm probably just gonna start getting ready throughout this video i'm gonna be reviewing the bali body gradual face tan and this is a hydrating cream i'm so excited about this because not only is it going to basically hydrate my face but it's also going to tan it so as you can see like my face is just a lot lighter than the rest of my body. I'm gonna be testing out this product throughout the entire weekend and just see if I really like it. I'm going to use this as my moisturizer um, before I get ready. And then I'm probably going to end up putting this on before I go to bed as well. I think I'm going to actually use it with this little kabuki brush just so that I can really blend it into like my hairline and just make it look really seamless and natural. This is the other thing is that it has like a pump where you pull down and it brings the tan like the perfect amount onto the surface of it. I'm gonna take that, pretty much just go all over my face. Ooh, it's my first time using it. So I'm really curious to see like how good it feels on the face. I'm also gonna go down my neck cause I feel like it'll be a little bit more seamless. Um, once that tan develops. I really don't like oily, like really, really thick moisturizers for my face. I was kind of worried it was gonna feel like it's gonna clog my pores or just be like heavy on the face, but it's pretty light. It seeped into my skin already. And I honestly did get like a pretty good glow from that. But we're just gonna see over the next couple of days how this actually looks and how it really can like match the rest of my body. I will catch up with you guys once I'm all ready and kind of when we're out and about. So I'll see you guys then. Okay, so this is my outfit for tonight. It's pretty like casual, I guess, but like still cute. So this top is from Shein. These pants are from Lux Kill. This bag is also from Shein, but I've been loving like mixing patterns and textures and then i have some jordan ones on so yeah i'm excited to just explore a little bit i'm just gonna catch you guys when we are out and about Oh, the guy staring at me. You can like carry that. <laughs> like Dora the Explorer. <laughs> That's actually so cool though. We just got an awesome parking spot pretty easily, but we're at the beach. <laughs> I haven't been to the beach in a minute. As you saw, we were at Walmart getting some chairs. They weren't even that expensive, like 30 some dollars. That's the chair. <laughs> but, so yeah, we're gonna have ourselves a little beach day. Skin is doing absolutely terrible on my chin area, but look at that. That Bali body, like moisturizer, gradual face, like face tan stuff is kind of working. 
This looks absolutely disgusting right now. The cheese is like <laughs> borderline melted. These are so good though. Little coconut chunks, mango, and then good old Heinen. Literally <laughs> the storm in the back. <laughs> Rachel, how is that? It's a good cushion for your head. <laughs> These new chairs are very nice. It's got like a face hole over the pillow. She's already going in, but we went to this. It's just kind of Majority. like how like a jungle gym is. Like they just have like so oriental good. food. Oh well, they're so good. Cappuccino flavor. Oh my god. So this is what I got. I got the most random stuff. These are like the Asian version of hot Cheetos. Oh my god. They're there. like the gourmet version of like hot Cheetos. Oh, it's got a kick to the end. No, that's so good. <gasps> I like baked Cheetos flavor. Mm -hmm. Like like texture, I should say. Texture-wise, yeah. Mm -hmm. Way better than hot Cheetos. The flavor is so much better. Where's the flavor? Where's the flavor? Wait, gotta give it a sniff. Ooh. A raspberry yogurt. That's good. Mm-hmm. Kimchi, of course. I'm excited to try this because I've tried kimchi on my channel before and it was disgusting because it came from Whole Foods. This I randomly got because I just, I don't know, it looked really good. Mm -hmm. I wish they it's had like, like hazelnuts instead of almonds in there. Oh, that would be that would game changer. What? I'm just gonna do it. Mm -hmm. as well. oh. oh no. Never mind. Wanna try it? Yeah, you try it first because it's, <laughs> it's like a little scary to me. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, oh my god. What is that TikTok? <laughs> Excuse me, wait, oh, and then they wait. bring it up. <laughs> about to go to lemongrass, and this sushi better be. Oh, you'll love it. You'll like it a lot. Oh, like, I yeah. guarantee you, you'll really like it. If I like sushi, then I'd have to like yeah. lemongrass. Probably gonna get in a If you appreciate fresh different. fish and, like, you know when it's, like, yeah. buttery and, like, just melting. Melts in your mouth yeah. like that. Oh, ooh, I'm excited now. See you at Lemongrass getting sushi. Mm -hmm. Today was just kind of tiring, but I don't regret any of it because it was such an amazing day. The beach was so much fun, and honestly, like, I got so much sun. I'm trying to, like, wear my baseball cap um, as much as I could to keep the sun off of my face. Today was such a good day, and I thought I would just um, get ready for bed, show you guys a little skincare. I'm still dealing with this, like, boulder that is arising. It's like underneath of the skin and it like hurts like a bruise. I'm going in with the Bioderma Micellar Water. This is pretty much just like what I use to take my makeup off, but I also just like to use it to like cleanse my entire face. After I shower, I like to cleanse my face again. I'm really hoping that the ocean water can kind of clear out my hormonal breakouts right here. Okay, so next, I think I'm just going to go in with the Bali Body Gradual Face Tan, and this is the hydrating cream. Seriously, love how hydrating this stuff is. Um, as you saw, I used it the other night, and I really liked it. I thought, like, my face was going to get some sun and match, like, the rest of my body. I'm trying to protect my face as much as I can, so this guy right here is going to be a lifesaver like i'm telling you guys right now 
this stuff is so hydrating i don't know if you guys can see but it gave me such a nice glow and it's super super soft on the face so i'm still gonna see how this develops over the next couple days but i feel like applying this at night and just kind of sleeping throughout the night i'm hoping i'm just gonna wake up with a tan face yeah i'm kind of just looking at the ingredients right now and it seems like it's actually like a really nice skincare product it's not just like a gradual face tan and it's not going to break you out so this right here is actually like skincare meets face tan probably just see you guys in the morning to see if there's any sort of difference i feel like if i incorporate this like into my skincare routine my face is going to be like the same color as my body so yeah that was basically my little skincare for tonight um like I said, I'm so <laughs> exhausted from today. We were just like going around like St. Pete's the entire day because there's just like such good food and that little oriental Asian market like grocery store that we went to was so nice and I'm like, that is gonna be so dangerous for my bank account. I wanted to get everything there. I had to literally limit myself because I just kept on seeing like random stuff that I just wanted to try. Tomorrow, we are gonna be probably going to this like pool area. It's like kind of like a day pool party kind of vibe. They have like cabanas, they have like a tiki bar, like a different bar, but then it's just like a big pool area where like not just people from the hotel can go to, but like pretty much anybody. So. I think we're gonna try that out and see how it is. I'm gonna probably just chill out for the rest of the night and kind of just binge watch Queen of the South a little bit more and then just go to bed because I really want to have all my energy for tomorrow to just wrap up this fun, exciting weekend. So yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. So it's currently the next day and I think this tanner on my face actually worked. My face is literally the same colors my body also i didn't wash my hands um after i had applied it and so now my hands are a little bit more tan than i would want them to be but um hey at least i know that it actually works i think i'm just going to pretty much get ready now and just get started for the day pretty much just in my hair i used my little like waver tool thought i'd show you guys like a little summer makeup look Kind of thing it's not gonna be too crazy obviously because it's so hot here and my makeup would pretty much melt off my face just going to run this morphe micro brow pencil in the color chocolate mousse and just kind of run it through my eyebrows not really like shaping them in a way but like just to have it a little bit filled in I know. <laughs> so I'm going to put some clear brow gel in my eyebrows just to like keep them in place. I'm going to put a little bit of moisturizer on and this is the Natural Moisturizing Factors Plus HA moisturizer this is by the brand the ordinary this stuff is literally like nine dollars this is good to use throughout the day but i usually have to put on a face oil and then put this on or like some sort of serum before i put this on if i just use this it doesn't really work as well now i'm gonna go in with the la girl pro conceal concealer and this is in the shade light tan i'm pretty much just gonna put a little bit of concealer under my eyes because i have dark circles okay i need to conceal these as much as I can. <laughs> I'm just gonna blend this out with a kabuki brush because I feel like it just makes the process go a lot faster and also kind of gives it like a natural blend. Yeah, this concealer is absolutely amazing and it honestly is not thick at all and this stuff is like what four or five dollars at Ulta. Now to conceal this problem area. I'm just gonna use that same concealer and just go on some problem areas. I'm going to use this Hourglass Veil Translucent Setting Powder to just lightly, like very lightly set my under eyes and 
the other places that I concealed. I do need to put this um, CeraVe facial moisturizing lotion. This is SPF 30. So like I said, I'm trying my hardest to just like protect my face as much as I can from sun damage. I'll pretty much just pat this in because it kind of gives you like almost like a white tint like all sunscreen does. I just need like some sort of protection on my face. Kind of just in those areas that I get a little red like on my cheeks and my nose. I'm not going to be using like a tinted moisturizer or any sort of like foundation on my face. Sorry, my camera died. But um, as I was saying, I'm gonna use the Milani Supercharged Cheek Plus Lip Multi Stick and this is in the shade Peach Thrill. I gravitate towards more like peachier blushes because I just don't think my skin tone looks good with like a rose kind of undertone blush. Especially during the summertime, like I feel like this kind of color looks so good with a tan. I'm gonna take the Charlotte Tilbury Desert Haze Luxury Palette of Matte. Pretty much just gonna use this brown right here on a little angled brush and just kind of place it more on the outer part of my eye. I'm literally not being precise with this at all. Then I'm gonna curl my eyelashes have to have waterproof mascara. I apply waterproof mascara regardless because it helps your lashes stay up more. Okay, I'm gonna use some Plumped Up Pout Lip Gloss by Ulta Beauty. I'm just gonna use this Morphe setting spray. I don't think I need this, but I might as well because it feels really nice. And this stuff smells so good. So this is pretty much the makeup look. It really is not that crazy, not a lot to it. Gradual face tan by Bali Body just made my face look like one with my body. I really didn't even have to use a tinted moisturizer, like nothing really on my face besides some concealer and some cream blush. You can just go through my makeup tutorials, any videos that I don't have makeup on, it's always paler than my body. So honestly, I really do like this stuff. I'll pretty much have everything like linked down below for um, this gradual face tan. If you're looking for a face tan, I know a lot of people are worried about it clogging their pores or just it breaking them out, but this face tan is actually like a skincare product. Definitely get your hands on it if you can. I know that their products sell out pretty fast when they launch something. I think this is the vibe that I'm gonna go for today is this bikini and then it has like a little cover up to go with it. I will pretty much catch you guys when we are at the pool. I don't really know what to expect of it though because I've never been there but I heard it's like a lot of fun on Sunday so we'll see kind of how it goes. I'll see you guys there. So, um, it's been a day or two since I've last vlogged. Let me just say I have been seriously loving my skin. Um, I don't know if it's because of the Bali Body, um, gradual face tan hydrating cream that I've been using. Gradual face tan is the only thing that I've been incorporating into my skincare routine that's new. So, I feel like it's not a coincidence that my skin is doing a lot better. I was genuinely surprised at how amazing this product is for my skincare routine and it just like honestly cleared up my face i was dealing with breakouts like the entire weekend and it completely cleared up so once again i'm gonna have all of the details down below for this gradual face tan seriously though if you can get your hands on this please do so because i think this is just like my favorite moisturizer now i really hope you guys enjoyed seeing just kind of like a weekend in my life even though it was just like little snippets um mainly because every place that we went to had some sort of music playing in the background and i couldn't necessarily like talk there anything like that or else i'd get copyrighted so that wouldn't be fun if you guys are in the florida area like let me know different things to do around here because I really don't know the area that well at all. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this little vlog and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!